Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do the iCloud bypass with one click, okay? We don't have to use the terminals with this video or with this method. And also, I'm gonna show you how to fix the issue that everybody was having that could not download any apps from the App Store. So, I'm gonna show you how to fix that, and it's really simple. For that, you only gonna have to follow like three or four steps and that's it. You don't have to download anything. So let me show you real quick that this phone is iCloud Lock. So let's go through the setup. Okay, let's put in the Wi-Fi, right? Let's put the password and we're back. And we're just waiting. Okay, now it's loading. Here we go. Activation Lock, all right? So, I'm gonna show you how to do this. The first thing we gotta do is we have to jailbreak it. And for that, we're going to use Check Rain. And I'm gonna leave you the link in the description for these two programs, Check Rain and the other one, which is the, the program that we're gonna use to bypass with one click, okay? So, let's open up um, Check Rain. It's right here, all right? So all we gotta do is we're gonna hit what it says star. Okay, so when we press star, it's gonna take you to this um, other page and it's gonna tell you that basically you need to put your device in DFU mode, okay? So let's click next and as you can see the, the iPhone turned off and it's starting the process already. Okay, it's preparing the iPhone. Okay, so if you get this pop-up, just ignore it. This is um, from iTunes stuff, so let's ignore that and let's bring back um, Check Rain, okay? So here is the process, it's really simple, just follow the instruction. So we're gonna hit start and we're gonna hold the power button and the home button at the same time, okay? It might be different in your iPhone, just follow the instruction. All right, so we hit it, let's go. Power button and home button. And now we're gonna release the home button. We keep holding the, sorry, we release the power button, we keep holding the home button, okay? All right, so that's it. Now we're gonna see Check Rain doing his thing. All right, there we go. So it's jailbreaking the iPhone, and one is done, we're gonna see, okay? So the iPhone is rebooting, and let me show you in the computer, one is says, I believe it's gonna say all done. Okay, here we go. It says all done. And that's it. We don't need this anymore for now. Okay. So let me just take this thing out. Okay. So now we're gonna use the other program, the one that is check ma.info iCloud bypass tool. Okay. And with this one, all we gotta do is just press what it says start bypass. Like I said, it's one click, that's it. Just click it there and that's it. We just gotta wait for it to do its thing. And now it's done. As you can see, the iPhone is now restarting. And that's it. It was a successfully method, okay? And now let's wait for the iPhone to come back. All right, it's turning on. And here we go. We already have the iCloud bypass. As you can see, I'm already in. This is how easy it's getting, okay? So let me show you now um, how we're gonna fix the, the applications, like I said, to download app from the App Store. So um, first of all, let's open the App Store and we're gonna try to download an app. So, just go where let's see let's see let's okay let's just pick any app let's pick the first one right here and we're gonna hit what it says get on top right here and we're gonna wait and it's asking us to put our apple id or to create one so what we're gonna do we're gonna go to the top that says rk right on the bottom and right on top, we're gonna hit where our picture should be. And we're gonna put our Apple ID or you're gonna create one, whatever you choose to do. 
So I'm gonna put the one that I have. And once you finish, we're gonna hit what it says sign in. Don't hit what it says done. Hit what it says sign in. And we're gonna wait. Okay, it's taking a little bit longer. And okay, it's asking me for the two factor authentication. So the code was sent to my Mac. And let me just put it. All right, I got it. All right, it doesn't matter that you guys are seeing the numbers that are put in here because it changed all the time. Okay, once we're in, okay, now we're in. So now we can hit done. All right, so let's hit done. And now let's go back and we're gonna go to settings. All right, so we're not gonna download any app yet. We're gonna go to settings. And what we're gonna do is we're going to scroll down all the way down to where it says iTunes and App Store, okay? So we're gonna click here and we're gonna go to password setting. It's right on top. It's gonna be under your Apple ID. Then we're gonna check what it says always require right here. So you check there and you're gonna turn off require password, okay? So now we're going back and we're also gonna turn off app updates and that's it. That's all you have to do. Now we're gonna go back to the app store and we're gonna try to download, uh, let's do the same app that, that we tried before, okay? So right here, Pokemon Master. And let's just wait, okay? All right, install. Um, why he asked me that is because it was the first time that I installed this app. I didn't have it in my account. If I would have had it, it was gonna show the icon of the, like a little cloud or something. So it's now downloading as you can see. Okay. So this app is big, so it's gonna take a while. So let's just skip through the whole thing. Okay, so now we finished. And I'm just gonna show you right here, okay? All right, so let's go back to the App Store and let's open it from here. You can open it from, from the home screen or whatever screen that it was downloaded to. So you don't need to open it from the App Store, okay? So here we go. You have the app already, it's opening and it's working fine, okay? So let me show you real quick. Let me download another app. This time I'm gonna download an app that I already own. So you guys can see that even um, with your own Apple ID, it's gonna work, okay? All right, so right here, you can see the icon. You have the little cloud icon. That means that I already own this app. And let's see, it's downloading or oh, it's loading. So, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And here we go. It's downloaded already. That one was fast, really small. And this one, let's open it from, from the home screen or from the screen that it came out, all right? So right here, it's working fine. And now, like I show you, we fixed the, the problem or the issue that all this bypass was having it of downloading app from the Apple Store. So let me just turn it off and show you that once it comes back on, we still have the iCloud bypass. And the apps that I download, they still there, okay? So let's just wait for the phone to come back, turn on. Okay, and here we have it. We still have the bypass, and as you can see the apps, they were there, okay, right there. It's working fine. So that's it. That's how you do the bypass with one click. And we also fix the, the issue with the Apple Store not allowing us to download apps, okay? So that's it for this one. I hope you liked the video. If you like it, please hit that thumbs up, subscribe, share, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.